Hi, my name is Brie. I talk about all things vegan and cruelty free, mainly beauty. We're gonna get into my PR and boxing of my Ipsy Glam bag and my box charm by Ipsy. I don't make any of these choices. I do also pay for the box charm by Ipsy, which I definitely will be getting this month. The choice selection opens up April 1st to the 3rd. So stay tuned for that. First, we have this really adorable bag. I also do spoilers. If you want to save a date on spoilers, I post as many spoilers as I can in my video sometime, you know, the month prior. But look at the little peach, little peach. And then there's a bag, really cute. And then the inside is like yellow and peach with a gold, yeah, gold, zip, gold zipper. So we have from Avant. We have gotten some things from Avant before. I have a cleanser that I'm still using up. And then I think I've had a moisturizer, I wanna say. But this is the Avant Avocado Sweet Almond Jojoba Grapeseed Argan Oil. What is the name of this? Why is it like so complicated? Yeah, Advanced Bio Restorative Superfood Facial Oil. Has all these things labeled on it. I'm like, can you just say what it is? <laughs> Probably something expensive. I don't even know if this is a full size or not, but like that brand is not cheap. And then we have this really cute palette. This is the Chica Beauty Fiesta Mini Eyeshadow Palette. So our Fiesta Mini Eyeshadow Palette is inspired by San Antonio's vibrant Fiesta Week. Celebrate with us as we capture the colors, culture, and joy of our hometown's music, art, and cuisines. Let every day be a fiesta for you. Vegan, clean ingredients, cruelty-free, recycle. That is us. And then I have this cute palette. It is a little bit like raised. And then the shade names. And then just like a little baby mini palette. I don't know if I'm gonna use this or give it to a friend. Anybody who's watching this that's friends with me, let me know if you want this. But I have a lot of palettes. It's really cute though. It's like a little compact baby palette. And it's cool that it comes in the bag. And then we have, I have a full size of this that I believe I got last month. I believe I got either last month or the month prior. The Do of the Gods Amal, Malfi Gold Heaven Grade Hair Serum. It's a little baby mini, so I don't need two of these. My, I'm probably gonna use it for my daughter. And then another product from Elemis that they're not cruelty free, but this is the Superfood Glow Priming Moisturizer. Again, I'm gonna go to a family member or a friend. And then the this is a big lip liner, like full size, full size. The Scone, S-K-O-N-E, Luxe Lip Liner in the shade Cosmo. It's like a pretty nude color. It's almost like a MAC lip liner. Never tried anything for MAC, it just gives me MAC vibes. So we have that little palette for the Ipsy Glam bag. In the box from my Ipsy box, we have this brush set. It is a five piece brush set with like rose gold ferrules. Only thing is these two brushes, I probably will use them as like fa like for my face because they're huge. And but the three minis look really nice. These are from B O D Be Your Own Desire. So it's B O B Y O D Be Your Own Desire. So it's kind of just cute. And then you know I can never complain about having more brushes. I recently found out that First Aid Beauty is not cruelty free. They used to be cruelty free, and now they're selling in China. So not happy about this. Everything that comes in box from my Ipsy is full size. And you get to choose three products and then two are power picks depending on like your quiz which i just switched up my quiz so hopefully we get in some different things this is the deep cleanser with red clay i like first aid beauty so it like breaks my heart that they're not cruelty free anymore so i'm not gonna be i haven't bought from them in a long time because i get so much stuff from box drawn but yeah anyway that's gonna go to a friend and then i need to double check to make sure this is cruelty free i think it's vegan it is almost like a soft, it's like a soft touch packaging. I think like NARS, which they're not cruelty free, but you know, you know the vibes. No Chill Mascara. It is a brown mascara. Yeah. No Chill is an ultra lengthening and volumizing mascara. The cone shaped silicone brush is designed to wrap the formula around each lash while separating them. The non flaking formula lifts and builds on top of the lashes with each swipe while thickening the base of the lashes for a fuller, fuller look. This is from lava it's l-a-v-a-a -A -A, los angeles smudge proof i mean we'll see if you're cruelty free and i can use you and then this is from violet voss but look in the inside it gives me old school i don't know if they still do this for their holiday palettes but this gives me like old school two face vibes see violet voss pretty in paradise all in one face and eyeshadow palette who remembers violet voss in like circa 2015 like the um what was it laura lee had a palette with them i think it was nicole Concilio had a palette with them. So 
there's a palette and then look tell me that does not remind you like toothpaste it's pretty i don't know if i'm gonna keep it or not um i have these shades but they, i mean it's a pretty palette i don't know about this bronzer this almost looks like a blush um the thing i don't like about face palettes is that they don't work for everybody so but it's pretty we just we'll see or maybe i'll put it in a giveaway we shall see and then lastly we have from buxom I've not had a buxom product in a long time actually so i have an eyeshadow palette from buxom that i was gifted by my cousin's partner um during christmas time that i really like that's like a five pan and then i have had you know right russian lip liner of course and i think that's all i've had from buxom this is a buxom plump shot sheer tint collagen infused lip serum and it's vegan collagen i looked and they are cruelty free it was a plump increased volume decreased lip lines 94 percent said they saw instant results out of a study of 30 people our most advanced lip plumper in a sheer pop of color so it's in the shade dolly babe and it has like a mint but not like too, not super toothpaste not super tooth toothpaste i can't like i mean it reminds me of like mint chocolate chip but it's in this pretty packaging and then It has like a cooling event effect. Not, I actually like the ones that have like a cinnamon kind of burning effect. <laughs> they never really burn my lips, but that doesn't bother me. I do like the color. What do you guys think? That is what I got. Stay tuned for spoilers, stay tuned for choice as well. I will be doing another unboxing of my paid for box. That's later on in the month. So let me know, would you choose any of these products? Would you not choose any of these products? I'm going for the Lunar Beauty Blush Palette. That I'm hoping it's a power pick for me, please. Or I'm gonna probably add it as an add-on because I've been wanting that blush palette for a while. So we'll see. Sometimes there's other products besides the spoilers that are in my, that are in my videos, but I will show you. And I possibly will show what I picked in the options that I had it depends on your quiz what you have options like what your picks can be like power picks as well as um your choices and then i also boosted my box so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna be getting the the tarte man eater palette the big one that came out i think it was 2022 i was working at ulta and i did not buy it so if you enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe i would really appreciate it and comment down below what you want to see in box of charm or is this are these products that you yourself enjoy getting in boxes or paying for yourself or paying for outside of getting boxes stay safe healthy and do something that makes you happy